thank you for taking time to view this tutorial. Today what we're going to do is create a wireless group policy in our Windows Server 2008 domain controller. So uh, be sure that your server is actually a domain controller. If you need help doing that, I've created a tutorial video that's out here on my YouTube channel. So take time to view that uh, tutorial first. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to log into my domain controller. And this takes just a moment here. And what we're going to do is we're going to pre-configure uh, users' computers to use our uh, to implement the wireless configurations that we want for all the computers on our network. So what we're going to do to get started with this is we go to start and then navigate to the administrative tools and we want to look for group policy management. And when this starts, what we're going to want to do now is we're going to want to create a new group policy. So we'll do this in my domain. Okay. So we navigate to the group policy objects. And we want to right click and select new. And when you create any group policy, you want to give it a name. And when you're naming these group policies, you should make the name of the policy meaningful. So for this particular uh, tutorial, I'm actually creating a wireless group policy. So I need to name it something that will be easily um, identifiable when I'm looking at the uh, policies that are applied. So I'll start with the I'll call my policy wireless LAN. Okay, so the policy is created, but right now there's nothing in there. So now we need to configure this policy. So the easiest way to get to this is you right click in here and select edit. And this will bring up the policy management editor. This is where we're going to actually add the rules uh, and for the group policy. This is where we're going to uh, configure what happens when this policy is applied to either a computer or a user. So for this particular one we want to look at the computer configuration and then we want to look at the policies. And for this I'm following a tutorial out of a network security textbook. If you're in my network security course then this is going to uh, help you with your uh, assignment hands-on project 6.2 and then we want to expand security settings now we're going to look for wireless network policy since this is my wireless network group policy go in here and we want to create a new Windows Vista policy So we'll call this Secure Wireless Policy, give it a description, And we're going to leave this use Windows Wireless LAN Auto Config Service for clients. Now we're going to hit Add. And we'll say this is the infrastructure. And we'll give this profile a name of Secure Profile. In the network name, you'll enter the name of the network that you want to connect to. So I'll enter the name of my uh, wireless network and we want to get rid of this guy here the new SSID so remove that add in just the one that we want 
and we'll say we want to connect even if the network's not broadcasting because we may or may not hide our SSID. I can go in here check the security. I can change the authentication type. I'm using WPA2 Enterprise. So I'll select that and I'm using AES encryption. So all those details are correct. I can hit OK. Tell this OK and I can now close out of my group policy management editor. Okay, so now I've created the wireless LAN group policy and the last step that I want to do is I want to actually link this group policy to everything that's in the yerby.com domain. So I'll go to the root yerby.com, I can right click here and link an existing group policy and down here will show me a list of the possible choices I have. Wireless LAN is the one that I want to link and it links it. One thing to keep in mind is there's a couple options in here. You can have the order that the policies are applied and it does that does matter. Uh, you can have if that policy is enforced. So that concludes this tutorial and so what we've done is we've created a wireless group policy and we've linked it to all uh, machines in the domain. Thank you.